a Pennsylvania Uber driver encountered an unfortunate fate when she accepted a ride, unbeknownst to her, that would be her last. On February 10, 2020, Christine Spacuza waited in her Uber, expecting the requester, and after a while, this man in hoodie, being the requester, entered the car from behind. Unknown to Christine, he was an armed robber. Identified as Calvin Crew, he booked the Uber with his girlfriend's phone number. Police say the man in the back is the suspect, Calvin Crew. You see Crew get in the back of Christy Spacuza's Uber. This was back in February, the video released by the court yesterday. Calvin Crew hopped in the Uber and ordered her to drive. Less than 20 minutes into the ride, he pulled out a gun and pressed it to the back of Spacuza's head. Terrified, Christine began to plead, making him realize that she has a family with four kids. She pleaded not to be killed. Man, I got a family. What are you doing? I got doing? a family too, now drive. What are you doing? Drive. Please stop. Drive the car, miss. I have four kids. What are you doing? According to the detectives, Calvin forced her to cancel the ride so it could not be tracked. Then he made her drive for an hour while he accessed her phone, checked through her bank apps, and transferred all her money into his girlfriend's account before killing her. Detectives say crew made Spacuza drive for an hour while going through her banking haps before the trial for Calvin. Two days later, Christine's body was found in the woods with a gunshot wound in the head. The district attorney sought the death penalty for the then 22-year-old Calvin crew when trials began. In this upsetting video, an Asian-American Uber driver got attacked by his riders who couldn't comply with his principle. It was a tussle over a mask during the coronavirus outbreak. It was all out war in an Uber over a mask. Three women are hassling the driver because he says one of them refused to wear a mask. Around 12.45 p.m. on the 7th of March, 2021, Subakar Kadka accepted a ride of three women. As they entered, he asked them to wear masks, but one of them refused. However, her reaction became too outrageous as she coughed on the man instead and even ripped off his mask. Watch as she does the unthinkable, coughing on the driver. <laughs> then the irate woman grabs his phone and rips off his mask. All through, Subakar was cool until the woman annoyingly grabbed his phone. He flared up with warnings not to touch his properties. Irate woman grabs his phone and rips off his mask. You, you don't talk to my property. The driver Reporting live on the incident, Subakar recounted how he drove them to a gas station so she could buy a mask. He never said anything bad to them, not even a curse. What then prompted the appalling reaction of the woman remained a mystery. I never said anything bad to them. I never cursed. So who is the woman in question? We've learned she has dozens of modeling pictures on Instagram. Today. This Uber dam camera captured how a driver got killed in a highway shootout. On August 28, 2018, around 2 a.m., the driver carried a passenger on a night drive. Suddenly, a truck overtook him and halted a few kilometers away on the highway. The truck driver bolted out and walked towards the Uber, which had also parked. The driver furiously charged at the Uber driver. Obviously, he has done something unbeknownst to him. I say something? The outrageous man brought out his pistol and shot the Uber driver. The Uber rider, shocked by this, reacted. The driver, however, couldn't escape the shot as he was heard saying he didn't see the truck earlier in an inaudible voice. Oh my God. Oh my God. I've been a bizarre and disturbing scene involving an Uber driver and a scam in Ohio has resulted in the death of the Uber driver, identified as Lolitha Hall. This also led to the arrest of William Brock, who was a co-victim of the scam video shows what are the last moments of a woman's life. That's Lolita Hall. She Gotten from the Uber dash camera, Lolita received a call to pick up a package at Brock's home. However, the caller had also called Brock and claimed a relative had been arrested and demanded a ransom. And he needed to pay a ransom or somebody would come and 
both of them. He has now faced charge after it was revealed both were victims of a scam. Unfortunately, Brock, believing the scam, shot Hall when she arrived at his home to pick up the package she was called for. She says two days before that incident, he received messages from a passenger asking him to stop on the way to pick up documents. Meanwhile, another Lyft driver, David Young, narrowly escaped a similar situation when a man, believing Young was part of the scam, confronted him at his home. The man claimed Young was there to pick up $5,000 to get his grandson out of jail in Cleveland. That's according to a phone call he received. The man believed Young was part of it, but it turns out it was- The scam is common among the elderly, and experts suggested creating a password with family members to verify identities and avoid falling victim to such deadly scams. You would never, you know, there are a lot of people though that fall for this scam. My and grandparents so, have fallen for that well, scam. Well, uh, my mother, I remember when she lived in Arizona, it was very prominent in Arizona. This Uber driver recounted a ride he had with a heavily intoxicated female passenger who scratched his car with her key and denied responsibility. Despite the driver's efforts to resolve the situation calmly, the rider became confrontational and lied about the incident. You sure you're all right? Yeah. All right. Oh! Hold on. Are you sure you're okay getting home? The driver reported the incident to Uber, but received an unsatisfactory response. However, this incident highlighted the challenges faced by these ride drivers and the importance of having evidence. But that definitely was not me, so. That looks like somebody was like trying to pump their gas and like. And what, try to put it with the thing? Well, that's there. like so far away from like your door. Are you kidding? Fortunately for this driver, he had dash cam footage to support and verify his accounts despite the girl's lies. You might think I overreact here, but when she said that, that told me she was ready to lie her way out of this situation. And the way I see it, lies are like seeds. In Philadelphia, an Uber driver was driving his Volkswagen Jetta down Highway 95 with his passenger when a terrifying accident occurred was driving his Volkswagen Jetta for Uber down I-95 while chatting with his passenger when he watched a car on the other side of the highways. As the camera picked up from a distance ahead, a car on the other side of the highway spun around for some time before it finally slammed into the guardrail. What really caused the accident was unknown, nor was the aftermath known, but it was a fatal accident. Around before slamming into the guardrail. It was a near-death experience for this Chicago Uber driver when the ride request he accepted turned out to be out of the ordinary. The driver was patiently waiting for his rider on March 17th, 2024. It was in the night, around 11 p.m. After a while, the door was opened and a lady hopped in. Immediately after she got in the car, she raised an alarm, ordering the man to drive, claiming a gunshot was to be fired at the car from an unknown angle. The driver quickly heated and zoomed off. Shoot up the car. Yeah, go. What the f What is go. that? What the f is that? Truthfully, gunshots were heard right behind them, which made him more terrified. He tried to flag down a police car passing by, but they were out of signals. However, what the f was that? He just shot at the car. For what? Let me call the police. Eh, f this. It was disturbing to note that the lady was caught in the camera laughing and not troubled as the driver. She definitely must have raised a false alarm, but thankfully, no one got hurt. In Australia, an Uber driver was cruising when an unexpected incident occurred on the highway. At midnight of May 2nd, 2023, the driver was driving at his average speed and hit a jaywalker, while another person close by came to the rescue. Immediately, 
The driver moved away from the scene as he could never tell if it was a planned attempt to endanger his life. Fortunately, he was able to escape and the jaywalker suffered minor injury. On March 1, 2017, an annoying road rager got what he deserved while trying to assault another road user on the highway. In this footage, the highway was busy without any alarming cause. Not until this happened a few miles ahead of the Uber. Some road ragers in black and red vehicles began to exhibit aggressive overtakes on the highway. The first driver tried to overtake the red car and the other did the same. The first driver again overtook and pressed the brakes, suddenly leading to a crash. He furiously alighted from his car and attempted to hit the red car driver, but the man fired a gunshot at him instead. He immediately ran away, leaving his car behind. This Uber driver shared his most scary encounter with his rider. On the ride, the rider was deep asleep and was snoring heavily. Suddenly, he let out a shrill scream that scared the Uber driver. Where am I? What was that? Oh my God, I'm so sorry. I just had a nightmare. Like paid double. The driver was so shocked that he almost lost control of the wheel. He flared angrily at the man and he apologized, responding that he had a crazy nightmare, a revelation that infuriated the driver the most. Okay, thanks. Don't defeat fine relative, you good. Just please get me home. Dude, get out! Are you serious? Here is another scary and worst experience of an Uber driver who was to pick up an army at a spot. He noticed a car pulling to his left and another to his right, but they were security guards. To my left, to my right, and my There's no just happened to Uber ride. Immediately, he maneuvered the car away, but it seemed like he was already trapped. The cars began to chase him while he was also trying to escape from them. Yeah. I was like, all right, looks like I got a fight. Look at this fool. Got me again, and there's a red light camera up there, so I'm like, I'm pretty much cops being like. Later, he got double crossed on the highway, but luckily, he still managed to take a reverse and escape. What these people want from him remains unknown. He's getting down, and the guy inside my car broke that fool's and I'm like, bro, I'm just a Uber driver. Major road safety precautions for drivers have always been not to drive when drunk or when feeling sleepy. However, this driver was driving alone on the highway when he suddenly passed out. The vehicle immediately swerved out of the highway, and unfortunately, there was nothing to stop it. The car continued drifting and wandering in the deserted terrain. Surprisingly, the driver regained his consciousness and took control of the car again. He maneuvered the vehicle back to the main highway and continued his journey. A terrible crash would have been if he hadn't regained his consciousness quickly. This Uber driver and his passengers were fortunate to have escaped a terrifying accident. The driver was skillfully driving while his four passengers enjoyed the comfort of the drive until the unexpected occurred. Unknown to the driver, a vehicle had lost control from behind and rammed into his Uber suddenly, swerved to the other side of the highway and halted. Oh. It was
was a terrifying scene, but thankfully, no one was hurt. The calmness of the driver on motion contributed to the safety of himself and his passengers. This couple deliberately endangered their lives by sleeping while driving. The car was driving itself while the couple was enjoying their sleep, but after a while, the car drifted and lost control. The man woke up immediately to control the vehicle, but it was late. The vehicle swerved left to right and the wife, scared, was screaming. Luckily, the vehicle halted and the man turned the car on the highway to continue their journey. In North Carolina, a heart-pounding shootout occurred between a professional Katz bus driver and a passenger. Unbeknownst to the driver, he was to be attacked by the armed rider. The driver noticed the passenger beside him and he turned his head, trying to hear him out, but he walked back into the passenger deck. Few seconds later, he appeared holding a pistol, not knowing that the driver was protectively armed too. The driver reached out to his shotgun immediately and fired at his attacker, who hurriedly ran back to avoid the shots. He was lucky the driver was shooting through the bulletproof glass door protecting the driver. If not, a shot would have ended him lying in his pool of blood. The driver went after the suspect and continued firing at him as he was running away. A Nissan driver forgot to keep the car within her lane and almost crashed this Uber in its lane. Recorded on 8th of June 2024, this Uber driver was driving his passengers on the highway when a driver incidentally drifted into his lane. He quickly steered the car away from being crushed and the woman apologetically waved at him. The riders were terrified at first and wanted to call the cops, but no one was hurt after all. This seventh grade young boy took a heroic step by promptly attending to a terrifying issue regarding his school bus and the driver. With his move, he was able to save himself and other students in the school bus from danger. Dylan Reeves, a student at Carter Middle School in Michigan, was on the school bus when he noticed the bus driver had fainted. The driver had earlier started feeling dizzy and tried stopping the bus but couldn't before passing out. Reeves ran toward the driver's seat and stepped on the brakes. He skillfully steered away from traffic before bringing the vehicle to a stop. As he successfully did this, he gestured to his peers not to panic. The situation was already under control, thanks to his bold step. In a midnight drive, 
this Uber driver ran into a jaywalker who crossed the road with his bicycle, an incident that ended up being fatal. The driver, however, was not concentrating on the road either. He was busy with his phone while driving. In the course of that, he accidentally hit the jaywalker to death. The epic driving skills of this driver saved him from a failed heist on a highway. Prinsloo was driving, and there were troubling bangs on his vehicle. He immediately steered the vehicle to another lane while trying to protect himself with the rifle in his car. His partner in the vehicle handled the rifle on standby. A few kilometers ahead, the armed robbers already had their truck packed in the middle of the highway, but Prinslow skillfully swerved past them, almost hitting one down. The heist could have caused a tragic accident, but Prince Lu avoided and prevented it at all cost. In this footage from an Uber Dash camera taken on February 16th, 2024, an unimaginable scene occurred in a red light stop. For over a minute, the Uber drive lane was stopped by the traffic light. Then, shockingly, out of nowhere, a white car abnormally drove into the traffic and the driver ran the red light, disobeying the traffic rules. On April 13, 2019, this Lyft Uber driver picked up a rich couple but ended up being a waste of time. Reporting this incident on the dash camera, the annoying passenger, Jenny, who had an open container of alcohol, threw it at the driver after being asked to dispose of it before entering as per the rules guiding Uber. Hello, uh, for Jenny? Yeah. 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 Hello. This infuriated the driver and he ordered them out of his car. He then called the ride-sharing company support and warned another driver about the incident. He threw yeah. alcohol on my front seat. There was nothing in his cup. He threw alcohol on my front seat. I emptied my cup and I threw it at you because Yeah, you threw off. it at me because, you, okay, well it's the- Meanwhile, a witness who was a former chauffeur corroborated the driver's account and offered support. He stated that the driver did the right thing and that the rider's behavior was ridiculous and absolutely insane. I would not take them. Uh, he, he threw alcohol at me. I'm on the phone with Lyft Support now because he, I had an open container and I told him no. On August 26th, 2022, in Lincoln, Nebraska, three vehicle collisions that resulted in damages were caused by a distracted driver running a red light. This heart racing scene was caught on the dash camera of this Uber driver. The Uber driver was waiting for the traffic light to pass him, and immediately it did. He ignited the car and drove forward. Unaware to him, an SUV across the lane was already speeding to run the red light which had stopped its lane from using the cross junction at the moment. Both the Uber and the SUV crashed into one another unavoidably, and the damage caused by the crash was much greater on the Uber, as the entire front end of the car was totally crushed. However, another car behind the Uber was also hit but the damage was minimal.
the drivers parked to attend to the issues, and the SUV driver admitted her fault at the scene. A police report was filed by the Lincoln Police Department. The Uber driver drove home while the other car was towed. The SUV car already had frame and suspension damage due to the accident. The driver had to climb out through the back seat as the door was jammed shut. This policeman was driving on the highway when an unidentified SUV suddenly crashed into the moving Tulsa police car. He was alone in the car, pressing the phone while driving. Single attempt to call 911. Immediately he got hit from behind. The phone in his hand flew away and he halted the vehicle. Thereafter, he managed to get down to check the state of the matter. A confronting dash camera captured the heart-pounding moment a 54-year-old Uber driver fell asleep behind the wheel on the Washington Highway. The Uber driver narrowly missed oncoming traffic and crashed into a tree by the other side of the highway from that footage, we can see a number of other road users on the road at the time. Yes, it's very confronting footage, and it's a wake-up call to all other road users. Luckily, no one was severely injured, but the incident sends a strong reminder of the dangers of driving when tired. This Uber driver shared his horrible experience during a night ride as he almost got killed by a strange pedestrian. I'm walking over here. What are you... Why are you walking here, though? Because I'm walking here. I'm walking through here. You cut me off. I was walking over here. A jaywalker aimlessly disrupted the Uber driver's ride. The driver had to halt the car abruptly and asked why he was not using the sidewalk, meant for pedestrians' use on the highway. Shockingly, the strange man drew out a gun and pointed it at the driver. <laughs> Bro, there's a sidewalk for a reason. Terrified, the Uber driver screamed and quickly rolled up the window. He left the scene immediately. Luckily, the man didn't fire an instant shot. An Uber driver named John got attacked by a passenger named Adrian in this footage. Adrian was heavily intoxicated and became increasingly aggressive during the ride. John asked him and his partner to put on their seatbelts, but they refused. Adrian's behavior became more appalling and thereafter resulted in fistfight as John couldn't take it any longer. Meanwhile, Adrian hit him first. However, despite having clear evidence and a detailed description of the assailant, Adrian refuses to wear a seatbelt, and by this stage, he's barely comprehensible. The police were unable to apprehend Adrian due to Uber's refusal to provide his personal information without a warrant. The incident left John shaken and unable to work, and he eventually quit his job as an Uber driver. This Uber driver shared his story about a rider, identified as Emedio or Mike, who got into his car with his partner smelling like feces. He even proceeded to be disrespectful and disruptive. All the while, the driver remained calm, but when he couldn't take it any longer, he asked them to get out of his car. Are you smelling that? Yeah, I mean... That's, I mean, that's, that's not me. Tip. No, I don't understand that, but... I didn't fart the situation could have escalated, but thanks to the calm and kindness of the driver and the other passenger, it was resolved without incident. Using this experience, he noted that even in difficult situations, kindness and class can prevail. Yo, check right. this out. Okay. Get, get your yeah. foot off there. All right. All right. We'll Guess what? Call Uber. Guess what? We'll get out. Yeah, right. you can pop out. In this footage, this Uber driver got heads up with a police officer who was his rider. The dash camera in the car was recording the moment of the ride, but the policeman objected to this, citing privacy concerns and a law change in 2017 that requires consent for audio and video recording. The driver, on the other hand, claimed to have posted a warning on the door, but the cop disputed this. The situation escalated, and the driver asked the riders to leave his car. 
The cop requested a refund, but the driver stated he cannot refund them as he is an independent contractor and not an employer of the Uber company. He therefore told him to issue his refund from Uber and not him. He immediately ended the trip and asked them to leave, categorically stating that they had trespassed. Did you issue, did you issue me a refund? Please, get out of my vehicle. Did you issue me a refund? I can't issue you a refund. On August 31st, 2019, this Uber driver stood his ground against disrespectful riders. He tried all his best to accommodate them at first, but he realized they weren't worth it. The dashcam video recorded the four passengers who had poor behaviors. One was even smoking a weed pen at the back and the one in the front touching the radio without permission. What? Do we have XM? No, we do not have XM. We do not. Do we have Bluetooth audio? The driver, unable to accommodate them any longer, eventually dropped them off. He canceled the ride, citing a lack of respect from the riders. He further explained having a dash cam to record everything to serve as evidence for potentially false reports to Uber. The passengers were unable to get another Uber due to their low rating of 4.56. And the driver concluded that some riders don't respect Uber drivers and that it is important to stand up for oneself. In the state of Louisiana, on March 22, 2019, this Uber driver couldn't accept being disrespected in his car, so he kicked out his rude riders. The driver was waiting for a couple who had ordered his ride, the couple hopped in after exchanging identification details. However, as they were hopping in, the Uber driver asked them to trash out the open containers with them. Open containers of alcohol while driving are illegal in the state, so he simply informed them that he was trying to obey the law, but he was threatened instead. The statement of the woman, we'll meet again, sounded like a threat to the driver, and he asked her to repeat what she said. The woman unapologetically repeated the statement. The Uber driver felt disrespected and ordered them out of his car. Here is another annoying encounter with some rude passengers, and the Uber driver couldn't help being disrespected too. In this footage recorded on September 26, 2017, this self-respecting Uber driver sets clear boundaries between business and personal respect. He picked up his riders and were chit-chatting when one of the riders insulted him by calling him names. It sounded like a joke, but he took offense with it, and he immediately canceled the ride, ordered them out of his car, asking them to book another Uber. The riders thought he was joking, but he was damn serious. He stopped the car and repeatedly asked them to get out of his car and order a new Uber. As they got out, he ignited the engine and zoomed off. Right now. No. Get that's out. Rude. Stop. She's joking. Get out. You left She's me joking out there. with you. She's joking. In this footage, this Lyft Uber driver got attacked by his outraged rider after he dropped her off on the highway without getting to their destination. On December 25, 2016, the Uber driver had picked up his drunk riders, one seated at the back and a lady in the front seat. The lady was on the phone talking with her worried parents, who were eager to know about her whereabouts upon realizing she was drunk. She claimed she was not drunk or hung over, and after a long call, she hung up. All the while, the driver had patiently tolerated her rants on the phone, but he couldn't accept the misuse of his property. As he hit the brake at the red light junction, the lady rested her leg on the car's dashboard, but the man immediately asked her not to put legs on it, as it is very expensive. However, the nonchalant and rude response of the lady infuriated the driver, and he halted the car. He ordered her out of his car, and after a hustle, he zoomed off. No, because I, we are paying for No, 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 no. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Oh. We don't have to do jack shit. This woman almost ended up being involved in a ghastly accident when her car was rammed into by an overspeeding vehicle on the highway. Luckily, she was not speeding. The Nissan Leaf rear dash cam footage recorded how a black SUV crashed the car, speeding at 45 miles per hour. The crash from behind hit hard as it made this woman's car ram into another vehicle before it. However, it was a terrifying moment for the woman, an unexpected incident. She was trying to take some water when the sudden crash occurred. 
the SUV suffered much damage, but thankfully, no life was lost. Video protected. In another heart-pounding rear-end crash caught on dash camera, this Uber driver suffered a rear car damage crash from a reckless overspeeding vehicle. It was on July 6, 2017. This Uber driver was driving on the highway when he suddenly noticed a vehicle that was about to ram into him. He quickly swerved the car around to avert the danger, but it was too late. The vehicle crushed him from the rear end. He couldn't help the situation, so he drove ahead. On June 2, 2017, an Uber driver ran into traffic when some outrageous driver drove past him at a high rate of speed. The annoying driver began to demonstrate some weird driving skills on the highway. First, he slowed below the posted speed limit and started brake checking the Uber. Later, he sped off again and he almost hit a truck pulling out from the parking lot. He continued his annoying driving until he got to the cross junction. He turned left to continue his journey, but he lost control of the car. As he tried to swerve the car to avoid crashing into oncoming vehicles, he ran into a pole on the sidewalk. He tried reversing the car, but the tires were only rolling in the air. 